Hello, you boys and girls of all. Welcome back to Oxygen Not Included, where last time we left off with um, our beginning of our power setup planned. And now it's almost complete. Uh, I have disabled these two generators because uh, until we get a smart battery to control the power generation, we do not want to produce too much um, because we do not need it. So uh, what we need all this power for is uh, getting more oxygen in. Uh, and we do this by desalinating water from over here, um, running it through an electrolyzer, and then we have to cool the whole thing down. And I think on this as right, we will use polluted water as a cooling fluid. So let's see what we can do here then um, oh. this being uh, a cool water basin we probably should use isolated tiles um. And we will need, we will also have to figure out where to place uh, uh, the cooling system. I mean, for now, we cannot really do much because for a proper cooling setup, we would need to uh, to get some steel but at least uh, that's where our basin for the for the cool water will go and then we can try over here to set up the thing as we go so as mentioned last time, we probably want to close off here. Uh, have a ladder going down there. Um, which means we probably want to have a pump down here. Pumping the thing up. Um, can we have this desalinator the other way around? So we have the input um, over on this side. Yes, we can. And then we get a water out here on this side. And then we need the setup um, for our um, for our uh, uh, water splitting. And um, think it's. Ah, here on the side, we have we have doors here with a one gap above, and then um, here we have solid floor. We have. gas pump here that's for the hydrogen and then uh, here on 
these sides, we have uh, the electrolyzers with airflow tiles below them. And then below, we have one, two, three uh, gas pumps for the hydrogen. So that means we have doors there and there. We need a level going down here. Um, we need to dig this out a bit. And then we can see about the pipe. Pipe going in here this way. Uh, here on top. We'll have two of these, which means we can connect them that way. And then we can combine two of these and then have one on the side. Then all that remains is basically the power wiring and for now we only have this and we need a bit more power going in here so uh, I think if we do it that way and then have these three connect to this one, we should be okay. And then we have a door there. Um, let's do it this way, connect that through here. And then we will see. We have that end over here. So let's pull that straight through here. And that means we will take through here have a bit of uh, of ladders going up and down there so we are still connected uh, this is now also all finished uh, here we need to set up the filter for natural gas and now that we have that set up we can connect this pipe and Then all that we need here on this side is a bit of uh, power to start the thing going. Breaking this open. Um, but I think I will let the duplicates uh, complete that part uh, first. Uh, because it's no use creating power um, if we do not need it. And then I think here on this side um, we will have um, a rock crusher. Yeah, a rock crusher. And let's see what we have in here. 
Let's take the ox from the seed. Uh, that hopefully we can put in this storage bin. Um, and once we have some uh, uh, pips in there, we might get some ox horns planted as well as some trees. But let's do, uh, or let's give the duplicates a bit of time to finish the work here. They have done quite a bit of work and uh, I have also placed the hams, hams wheel in here so we can load these batteries, have something for the rock crusher. We can get a bit of lime, a bit of salt and also a bit of uh, aluminium so we can have a smart battery and some uh, um, automation wire going on there. But we also have huge stress and that's probably uh, not helped by the fact that due to the wire that we use here, that's a really unattractive area. The duplicants spend quite a bit of time in this area and um, yeah, food wise not so nice as well. So uh, let's see what we can do about this. So I am thinking we will extend this level down here. Also dig this out and then have this dug out and put in another floor there. Which means, unfortunately, all this has to go. Um, we will also extend that floor to over here. So eventually we will have more bunk beds over on this side. But in here, uh, I want to actually uh, have... Um, uh, to actually have uh, the mess hall because that helps morale. I did manage to bring the stress down, at least um, in the meantime, by uh, scheduling two more slots for dine time. Um, however, now it's rising again. Uh, basically, because every time they run back here, they run out of air pretty quickly and the whole area is not re very nice to work in. So maybe now it's time to prioritize this one and it might be a bit difficult because we need a uh, plus 20 decor in here and without having an uh, artist uh, that's not that easy I hope I can manage um, uh, by uh, just placing in pedestals for four of those uh, because each of those should have a plus five so at least i hope that works out that way um but we will we will see and uh, of course we have a bit of chlorine in here it's really not that nice to uh, breathe in so that also hampers um, the high morale. But as you can already see, we are already uh, back on the downward trend. Uh, Rowan is uh, always the one uh, most critical. And uh, if we uh, see uh, stress here, change is was zero now it's minus five um, and uh, it's going down 
So then let's let's see. Do we have We are missing uh, decor items. We have the right size. Uh, we have the right size for a great hall. Uh, but we are missing the decor items. So, what can we place on there that's not too bad? Let's go with some... Some murk leaf seeds. And see if that does the trick. And once we have uh, uh, some artists, we can certainly do battle. Um, than what we currently have and if we clean up the floor that will certainly also help looks like uh, at least the morale issue is solved by now even though this is still not a great haul but we are getting there but the thing here really is the duplicates cannot uh, hold their breath long enough to get back here so I am thinking maybe what we need is a crafting station then um, maybe back here uh, a station and one dock. Does that work? Oh no, that does not work because we need oxygen for this dock. So Cancel that idea. We don't have oxygen. What we might be able to do is in that case have an oxygen diffuser here. That should help and then maybe, maybe in the next episode we can get some real progress on the oxygen there. But that's it for now. Until next time, goodbye.